Yo, what's going on, everybody? Hopefully, everybody's doing well. It's me, Devolt the Bear. We're back with another Xenomorph build. And make sure to slap a like on the video if you enjoy what you see. And sub if you want to see more. We do have some videos coming up. People have been requesting certain things. This is a request build right here. And we have a requested night build with them, which I'm not sure what we're going to do for that one yet. But let's go into the end game Xenomorph. First, we have Terminus. All right, relax, Xenomorph. We have Terminus. When exit gates are powered, this perk activates. While Terminus is active, injured, downed, and hooked survivors are inflicted with a broken status effect until exit gates are open. When exit gates are open, survivors will stay broken for an additional 30 seconds. We got no way out. After hooking a survivor for the first time, no way out gains a token. Once the exit gates have been powered, no way out activates. When a survivor interacts with an exit gate switch, you receive a loud noise notification. The entity then blocks both exit gate switches for 12 seconds, plus an additional 12 seconds for each token in your possession. Then we have Blood Warden. As soon as the exit gate is opened, Blood Warden is activated. The auras of any survivors located within exit areas are revealed to you. Once per match, hooking a survivor while Blood Warden is active calls upon the entity to block both exits for all survivors for 60 seconds. And they said I could add whatever I want for the last perk. And you know what I did? I just went full endgame. Why not? We're going to have Remember Me. Each time your obsession loses a health state, gain one token up to four. Each token increases the opening time of the exit gates by 6 seconds, up to a maximum of 24 additional seconds. The obsession is not affected by remember, remember, remember Me. Wow, sorry. And then we're keeping the improvised cattle prod from the last video. Each time a generator is completed, a 15 second timer starts. Any survivor who comes within 10 meters of a control station during that time has their aura revealed for the remainder of the timer. And then I chose Lambert's star map. Decrease the flame distance of uh, of turrets by two meters. All right, guys. I hope you enjoy this. Seeing what we got going on, I might switch the add-ons depending on what we do. But as always, I will see you in the match. All right, here we go. Greenville Square. Let's see what we can do with the Cinemorph Endgame build. These are always fun. I'm not. I'm not usually one to do this. Oh, what's up, Dwight? Oh, we're just giving up. Uh, all right. Well, we're just giving up straight away. That's what we do now. We get found first. We just give up straight away. No, no second chances later in the match. You know, it's not like you have two hook states that you get to go through before you die. I don't know. It's weird, man. It's been happening all the time, bro. It gets obnoxious. But hopefully you guys are doing well. Yeah, he's letting himself die on hook. It's super obnoxious. What is up, Sable? What is up? We got one stack and no way out, though. So there's that. All right. I'm going to chase Sable. Somebody did save Dwight. Maybe he'll come back. Who knows? We'll see. She did a nice fake there. Oh, ooh, that was actually a classy move right there. I, I, I quite enjoyed that. You did well. Can we get this? We sure can. Whoa. Oh, I know what you did. I know what you did. I saw you pop that. I ain't stupid. You think I'm stupid, don't you? I'm not stupid. Where'd you go? We wait these out. On the hook you go. No styptics here. Yeah, it's almost as if, like, uh, some survivors get mad that they get found first. Or, like, I mean, what, like, what do you want me to do? I'm just going to ignore him, actually, and we're going to go after somebody else. What is up, Meg? A little bit of sprint burst. That was expected, the way you were moving there. Let's see what we can do here. Boom. All right. That's a nice shot there. She must have... We have. We must have good ping in comparison to her because we did not eat that stun, dude. Oh, nice. That was, that was my fault, though. Oh, no. Panda. <laughs> what are we doing, dude? Sable. 
Sable, why would you do that, dude? I'm not getting no value out of the build. We're not even gonna make it to Endgame, bro. Not gonna make it to Endgame. We'll put her up. Um, I'm gonna guess. I don't know what. I don't know what the hell we do at this point. We're gonna. I guess we uh. We killed Dwight here. I'm gonna break this pallet first, dude. Just get some point. Yeah, she's letting herself die on the hook. We might as well. All right. We'll end this match. We'll throw him up on the hook, and that's going to call it for this one. Might throw this in just to show that people just quit, man. All right, we got Azeroth's resting place. Let's go. See what we got here. We're going to tunnel right away. Not the survivors, guys. I know. I know. I got to watch my phrasing, dude. Let's see if we can't find anybody uh, running around out here. What is this, man? These tunnels are kind of bad, bro. What do we got? What we... Oh, 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 oh. Hello, hello. Let's break this. We got two here. I heard somebody. I heard somebody. Where'd they go? No, what am I doing? I'm bad at the video game, bro. So bad. My tracking is not what it used to be, man. We get the little tag there. Love to see it. Ooh, she took the window. Interesting move. Interesting move. I like it, though. And she drops pallet. All right, all right. Let's see what we got here. Kate might be a juicer, bro. She might be the best. Or Ooh, she takes that window anticipating the fake, bro. Can we get this? Is she... Ooh, no, I missed. She is so much better than me at the game. Can I get this? I can. I hit your shoulder blade. Popped her right in the shoulder, dude. All right, we pick up here. We throw her on the hook. Kind of a little, I was a little disoriented. I forgot what map we're playing. We're playing the eye-shaped map, which is like... It's not bad. You have to pick a side, though. You can't just... You can't just protect everything. I'm getting a little framey, too. So... Okay. So they're working on two gens over here. That's actually really good for us. Um, that means we can hold the other side. We also have a body over there, which is great. Um, if they pop this gen... Which it sounds like they're going to. We're going to go after her because we want the stacks of uh, Remember Me. So we get this hit. We get that M1. They get the save. And she's running straight back to the other side. This is huge. This is great. Oh, but she cut back in. She, 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 she might have realized what she was doing. We get the hit there. Two stacks of Remember Me. This is great. We're going to pick up. And I want to kind of... I think I want to... Put her over here. Didn't realize that hook was that close. Okay, we're going to head back over here because they've done two gens over there, which means that this area is going to be a hot zone because if they don't do a gen over here, they're going to be in a bad spot late game. So let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. I might stay over here even if they don't. All right, cool, cool. We uh, we got three gens over here. I don't like doing this, but this is like the ideal way to play this map. I know it sucks, uh, but they've already finished two gens over here. What's up, Sable? See, she's heading back over here. Uh, well, we I think there's enough over here. I think there are enough of them over here to justify coming up, coming over here. Um. We'll chase Kate. Maybe tag Kate and get a little hit here. Ooh, I can't believe I missed that. That's a uh, that's rough actually. That hurts a little bit. I try to I try to keep track of everything going on. She's running back over here. Um uh, not I'm not sure why she's running back over here, but that's okay. We'll take it. We'll take it, dude. Uh Sable's injured over here. Ooh, little bunny hop? What are you doing? What are you doing jumping around over here? You're going to get hurt, Sable. 
You're gonna get hurt jumping around like that. We're just gonna M1 here. I wanna take my chances uh, and miss there. So we're gonna pop her up on a hook. And we're popping her up on a hook on this side of the map, which is huge. Means we can kind of stay over here, do our thing over here. We're going to make sure we check over here to see if anybody's on this. No. I do see Kate over there. She's she's chilling. She's not doing anything, so. Ooh, this is chugging away. Hello, let's get our stacks of Remember Me. I seen a bird fly. Are oh, you still over here? I don't want to spend too much time. It's weird. I knew, like, I I'm, I definitely saw two sets of scratch marks. I'm just not sure where the other person is. Huh. Okay. Well. Ooh. I don't even think I would have gotten that without without the burn. That was the, that was an ambitious strike. All right, he's putting that up. We'll break that immediately. Okay. He's gonna take the the next window, right? Yep. 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 He's juicing. Like I said, this is ideal though. We want to keep them on this side. He's gonna try and run to the opposite, but we're we want us we, we don't want him we don't want him to go very far. Can I hit this? I do hit that. So we are whoa little 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 stutter step there, bro. Yeah, so we're gonna pop this up. Boom. Okay. I uh, is that Rebecca? Yeah, it's Rebecca. What up? What up, Sable? Don't really want you right now. I want my, uh, want my four stack, bruh. I want my four stack. Nice. Ooh, they got that gen done. That does suck. All right, we'll pop her up on the hook. We'll pop her up. See what's going on here. Oh, she's, uh, she's not struggling, so maybe another give up? We'll see. I mean, we got what we need from her, so it doesn't really matter. But it's an endgame build, and we're not making it to endgame, dude. I mean, we might actually in this match. This is probably one of the best chances like I've gotten to get to endgame without somebody giving up. I heard... Yeah, I heard this. No, I didn't hear this. I thought he set up a... Turret, that must have came from Shaq. Okay, we'll go around the building. What up, dude? I'm not really sure what just happened there. Yeah, Kate's confused too. She's like, did you just use the, the force to hit him? I did. I threw my palm out and slapped him. Oh no, Rebecca's still in. I thought she gave up. But Rebecca's still here, guys. She didn't give up. All right, we got Kate here again. Hello, Kate. What are we doing? I mean, we don't really have to stay on this side anymore. Uh, I'm gonna tag her with the tail attack. I don't think she makes it very far, honestly. It's good. Ooh. Ooh, brother. Oh, brother. Ooh, we are getting, hey, hey, we're getting close to end game, dude. They actually finished two gens on this side, which is kind of nuts, bro. I've been over here the whole time. What up? What's up, Sable? Like, I've, I've been on this side the whole time. And these guys are just churning. Oh, she's going back? Is she going to Is she gonna try and go for the save? No shot, right? Yeah, she is. Is she going to get that? I don't think she gets this, right? No, of course not. I was about to say, she was a track star for sure right there. All right, we'll pop her up. See if Rebecca saved. Oh, Rebecca did save somebody. Awesome, you love to see it. All 
right. So Rebecca's over here. No, it's Kate. It's not Rebecca. What's up, Kate? I, I apologize. You're now dead. Out of the game. You had a good run. Better luck next time. Yeah, it's essentially like running no perks, dude. Alright, well, that's a GG. Maybe we find Hatch. Um, maybe we don't. That was a weird stutter. I don't know what that was. I checked the menu to see if they have any uh, offerings, but we'll see. Hatch game it is. All right, so we have a little bit of a substitution in for one of the add-ons, as I said, and I'm sorry about the quitters in some of these matches. Uh, I have, no, like, it's just a common thing, so I'm going to throw what videos I think will work in. If we have more quitters, I apologize. It's just the state of Dead by Daylight right now. People are just doing it anytime anything goes wrong. So what we have here is we have the, I, ha I hope I pronounce this right, the, the semiotic keyboard. Generators within 16 meters of a turret have the intensity of their auras determined by their repair progression. I just wanted to try it out, see if anything happens if we switch it up. That way we can kind of bounce around what uh, gens we need to be going to and stuff like that. While we also work around the end game build. As always, we're going to see you in the next match again. Alright, Father Campbell's Chapel. What's up, Maurice? Alright. So we didn't get any value out of the end game build last time. That Sable immediately got Hatch. Um, let's see if we have any better luck this time. Ooh, hello, hello. I'm going to grab from my box. I'm going to give up like the last person did. Last person, as soon as I, as soon as I got them, they, uh, not last person, but they, one of the matches, they, um, Gave up because I found them. Ooh, I messed up there. It's all right. We got it's a uh, it's not the shortest down, but we got it. Let's go. Put her up on the hook and see what we got going on. Yeah, so many like so many people just giving up nowadays, dude. I mean, I, I feel like I say that once a year. There's like, oh, okay. We got an AFK Nancy. That's all right. We'll go after Ace here. Ace wants to take some chase. That's all right, bro. Oh, come on, man. Yeah, I get it, dude. Look, she, she's back. She's back. <laughs> Why couldn't you just chase normal, man? Oh, that's not, that's not cool, bro. Like, you could never win in these situations, bro. So, like, here's what happens. If I go after the AFK person, right? A lot of a lot of survivors get mad when you go after the AFK person, right? So, it, like, this is one of the one times I was like, Alright, I'll take Chase with Ace. He's right here. And then Ace just leads me right back to the AFK. Of course, I'm just... I'm like, look, he's already quitting, bro. What are we doing? It's one hook state, brother. One hook state. You'll be all right. It's crazy. I deal with this so often, dude. And then people will, like, come at you for that. Like, well, you should have went after the AFK Nancy. And then when I do do that, well, you should have, uh... I might slug him if he's gonna, if he's gonna do that. You shouldn't, you shouldn't take advantage of the AFK players while you, while they're gone. Which is it? Which is it? Look, I'm not even going for him right now, alright? I'm just playing the game, bro. But if he's gonna be a baby about it, I, like, I could be petty too. I might slug him. I might slug him and just, like, do a rotation on these guys and just to get everybody some chase points and stuff. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. I was showing you her so you could take her down. I know, I know, Carlos. I know, dude. It's, it's, it's absolutely, yeah, see? It's absolutely ridiculous, dude. 
Absolutely ridiculous. Now it's your turn, right? We're gonna go. I see you. What are we doing? No, I'm not picking him up. Nah. What are we doing? All right. Well, I'm gonna go back to these two. I'm not, like, this is, this is what we deal with, dude. It's so it's so annoying. I'm gonna let them. All right. We'll better. We'll go after Sable. This is this is the average DVD experience with Killer, bro. I missed that. I missed that because I'm just sitting here casual. I'm gonna go around the building behind them. Sable, don't ever do that again. Don't ever do that again. You won't corner check me. I knew you were there. What's up, Nancy? You all right, Nancy? <laughs> Ooh, nice. Oh. Alright, one way, one way. I'll I'll break this. Giving him so many chances, dude. I'm gonna I'm gonna break this pallet as well. Uh, you know, like, give them a little experience, you know. Have let them have a little fun match. We're we're definitely just slugging Ace out, and I couldn't be happier that the survivors are doing the same thing. Yo, what up, Sable? I think you might have uh oh. You ran into me. You ran into me. It's just frustrating, dude. Anybody else get this way? Like, I hate to be a petty person, but if you're gonna if you're gonna ruin the match for everyone, I understand the AFK could technically be considered the one that ruined the match, right? Oh, he was gonna move. He was gonna move, but then he saw me. Um. Like, the AFK person could could te technically be the one that was, like, blamed for that, right? But, I mean, at the end of the day, they started moving. Like, you just, some people, maybe they went and made a Hot Pocket or something, dude. Give them a chance. Okay? She started moving as soon as I got close. Indicating the match would have proceeded. And she, you would have got saved on the hook, Ace. I'm just checking these gens. Looking for the Carlos. It's like, people are so dramatic. And then they'll be like, bro, it's just a game. Yeah, it's just a game, so relax. Don't let yourself die on hook because you got hooked once. Same thing. Like, I had somebody, uh, I was playing Clown, and I got obliterated, right? Got obliterated. Uh, I was playing on controller, and I don't normally play on controller, so I was like, I was all off. And I was, they were like, uh, I said, um... What the hell? I was like, oh, they were bagging at the exit gates. And I was like, yo, chill, chill out, guys. Chill out. Uh, what's up? I was like, Ch chill out on the tea bags. I, like, I, I'm, I don't have a lot of experience on controller anymore. And they were like, I don't like the killer that you play. And I was like, wow. Okay. <laughs> like, if you, if you treat people bad, and I'm not saying toxic, I mean, uh, Teabag is toxic or anything, but it, you know, it's uh, it's a little bit taunting when you're in the exit gates doing that because you don't like the killer. I mean, you have a, you have a decent roster of killers, man. You're like one day you're gonna go up against a killer you don't enjoy. I, I personally, there's, there's like, I honestly don't have a killer I don't enjoy. There are neutral ones where I'm just like, yeah, cool. All right, he bled out. I'm like, yeah, cool. I don't enjoy them as much as some other ones, but I, I, I <laughs> not the plot twist. You got a power struggle, don't you? What are you doing, brother? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick him up. He, I'm gonna guess he, uh, he has uh, power struggle. Yeah, yeah, there it is, there it is, there it is. The, the funnies, dude. Oh, he dipped out. I thought he was gonna be funny back. But you know what I'm saying, like, if people just, like, I understand there are some situations where some killers make themselves feel bad. Like, obviously, there's, like, stall merchants and stuff, you know, <laughs> and that uh, may not play to everybody's enjoyment. But at the end of the day, let people, let, let the killers play what they want. They're going to play how they want anyway. 
I, I definitely understand tunneling and camping and all that. It's not exactly fun for one side, but it doesn't really matter. I'm watching her, and she, I don't, is she going to react? <laughs> so this low walk out. Sorry, this, this this became this became a rambling video. Oh, she has. I didn't even know she had sprint burst, dude. Yeah, this became more of a rambling. At least this portion. I'm just kind of messing around with these guys because I don't. I feel bad because the ace was just AFK. Ironically, the whole match. Aside from that first chase. Oh, is Carlos done too? Alright, Carlos. I will grant you freedom as well. Except you stayed and made the funnies, so it, it's, it's, it's better. I'll put you on the hook. I'll give you an opportunity to stay in the game if you want to. Look at him. <laughs> that Nancy, she's so scared, dude. She's so she's so frightened. <laughs> Nancy, are you okay? Where'd she go? Nancy, where are you at? Oh, I hear her running. Nancy, look at the sprint burst go. Nancy. <laughs> All right, what are we doing here? Let me see what she she's actually kind of working with a fucking nasty ass build here. Pardon my French, guys. I apologize. That was a. Was a ooh, I'm stuck on this corner, bro. <laughs> Help! <laughs> this is a Jesus. Look at this setup, bro. And she's going. She's leaving it though. Hell, she could have looped me there all night. We get the tag there, though. That's an easy shot, though. I've been playing a few different killers uh, lately. I've been playing a little bit of Plague. Plague's fun. What's up, Nancy? You coming around here? Ooh, you trying to stun me? Mm, that's a terrible pallet against her. We'll pop her up on the hook. I don't know if... I'm necessarily gonna go into endgame with uh, Sable. Maybe. I don't know. Nah, I think we're just gonna go GG, see whoever finds Hatch. Alright, guys, so that's the video. Like I said, I apologize about any quitters or anything like that. The players right now seem to just, like, quit after anything goes wrong or if you do something they don't deem right to them. I don't know. Everybody's super sensitive. It's all, it's always good to see wholesome survivors and stuff, but, like, some of these just quitting right out the get-go. It's rough, and I might throw in a bonus one because we had a really quick match because somebody gave up super early. But I hope you guys enjoyed, and I appreciate all of you. Make sure to slap a like on the video and sub if you want to. It always helps me understand what you guys want to see. And so far, you guys have really been enjoying the Xenomorph videos. I'm glad I can bring them to you. It's my first P100. It's one of my favorite one of my favorite killers in the game, mainly because I'm a huge fan of, of the Alien series. But I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure to stay safe. Have a wonderful rest of your day, night, whatever it is for you. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.